Okay, Scorpio. So um, I'm a little late to getting everything up this week because I'm still not recovered for whatever freaking reason. Um, so I'm probably, unless I suddenly feel better this weekend, I'm definitely not going live. I doubt I'll have any extra content up, but you know, thank you for all the views. Thank you guys for getting me past 10,000. That was really awesome. These messages are for September and, um, it's whatever comes out. And again, I can't guarantee it's just for September. It could be anywhere, you know, in the timeline, but for Scorpio, sun, moon and rising. What do we want Scorpio to know for September? Some sort of justice situation. If this is a court case, don't worry. Looks good. It would be going in your favor. Um, though it looks like the stress is kind of going to eat you alive. Um, if this is some sort of karmic justice that you're stressed over, don't worry. Do not worry. Now, are you going to get an apology? Are you going to get the closure you want? Absolutely not. for Scorpio for September. Getting out of some sort of funk. Even though you're getting out of some sort of funk, it's like weird because you feel very like, it's almost like you're disassociating. Um, you feel very bland, like, uh, you know, you don't really care. You're, you're moving on, you're the Six of Wands, which is my favorite card, like marching forward, but you're like, eh, whatever, I'm marching forward. Scorpio for September. Somebody could be going to like a medieval festival as well. We have the moon here. Why is the moon here for Scorpio? Could be dealing with a cancer sign. Oh, something you don't see happening is a manifestation that will be coming true from September on, okay? Um, what is that about? What is that about? For those of you that want to reconcile, it's on the table, okay? It doesn't have to be romantic, but it is on the table. What is this reconciliation about? The number six is relevant. Could be an air sign, doesn't have to be. Somebody you really, like, saw a future with, they may have ran off with somebody else, that sort of thing. I don't see that really working out for you. I feel like that person's just coming into your life to cause chaos. Scorpio. Ending of some, yeah, you're now you're laying that to rest. I like it. I do like it. Who's this fire sign? Who's this fire sign? Secretly insecure, whoever this is. That's weird. All right, for some of you, this is a new person that will be coming into your life. It doesn't mean it's romantic, but this new person that's coming into your life, you might meet him during some sort of gathering that costs a lot of money. That's how you'd know. Or this is somebody you're going into business with or client or something that <clears throat> might be having some sort of financial issues. Um, it could be because of an air sign, not necessarily. It could be like one of those situations where they took the house or... They took the business, you know, something of that nature. For Scorpio, looks like you're moving on to find some sort of balance with your finances. So a lot of you are going to be changing. And again, this fire sign could definitely be somebody you're partnering, partnering with, okay? But you are holding on to some sort of new, new values or something that you... I, I think I want to use the word values. Like, definitely not saying that you um, were a pushover or anything like that, but it's almost like you have new boundaries, but also new values. I don't know. Uh, take it as it resonates, guys. <clears throat> this fire sign might be a little triggering, but I think it's just their energy. They're a little too much. Why is the star in the reverse for um, Scorpio? Wish fulfillment that doesn't work out.
could be because you were looking to travel or buy a new place or even move and you don't hear back. Just an FYI. Be, it's saying here to be grateful because it wasn't going to work out anyway. For Scorpio for September. <clears throat> You will be moving on. For those of you that have been holding on to something like a grudge or pain of any sort, September looks really good for you to just kind of like, you know, be able to um, remove that energy off of yourself. I do see a little extra money here for you, Scorpio. What's that about? Could be dealing with an earth sign, not necessarily. Now, options options i love it so else you have romantic options coming in or you have business options coming in and they look really good it looks like you you would be able to like um have a little bit of savings or maybe a lot of savings you know um especially if there's something you're in need of especially if it has to do with your self-care i would say hobbies even the scorpio what else Some of you are just tired of being single, and for others of you, you will be growing tired of being single, okay? If you're in a relationship, this may not resonate with you. Unless in September you become single, September, October. I see something brand new here. Could be... Could be meeting somebody new, like I think I already mentioned, or this could be... Um, That this change of perspective is what I'm getting. Again, this could be anything. Change of perspective is like so vague. Tell me more about that. No, please, Gomez, don't right now. Some of you, you're getting rid of some sort of addiction. And for others of you, like I said, change of perspective somewhere. And with it will come growth and prosperity. So it's like, you know... It's, it's like a valuable change you're going through. Dropping a heavy burden. There's that trip again. Might be traveling for work, maybe not, but I do I do see it could be even a move. It could be a move, but if not, it's a trip. It does look like it's work related, but it doesn't have to be. Anything else for Scorpio? Scorpio, if you're looking to buy uh, any sort of property, uh, if you're looking to work on your property, if you're looking to build a new business, if you're looking to start a side business, um, I don't know necessarily that it's going to happen in September, but it looks pretty good. It looks pretty good. You'll have a little um, bumps in the road, but it looks good. And it's going to get you out of your mind. So if you've been struggling with, like, you know, overthinking about something or dealing with depression or trying to get over some connection that didn't work out, this will, this will push you through it. Uh, just be careful with the next person. It's very love at first sight, okay? Very love at first sight. Tell me about this for Scorpio. You guys may not see eye to eye on what you want long term or even sexually. So just be mindful of that. I mean, I'm sure everybody can work through things, but just, just keep that in mind. It's like when I told you I, I, you can manifest and bring somebody in right energetically you get on the energy that you want the frequency that you want what you want to bring in you write it down if you choose to do this be super super specific like i i cannot stress that enough guys i really can't and i used to you know teach the girls how to do this lulu and all her friends and you know even my guy friends and something always goes wrong that's like Murphy's Law, something always goes wrong. So just be mindful. I mean, nobody's perfect though, right? 
Nobody's perfect, guys, and that is why I don't get involved, because I like perfect. Okay, you're not allowing something to happen. Okay, it has to do with jumping into this whole thing. So just like like I said, don't let your guard down right away. Don't jump into anything kind of irrationally. This is very like, you know, ooh la la, and you might be disappointed in the long run when you realize this person isn't entirely what they, or what you hoped. Um, now, again, this could be a business partnership where it just seems like oh, over the top, really fantastic, and oh my gosh, we're gonna make all this money, and you are gonna make all this money, but just, you know, you guys are not always going to see eye to eye either. Heavy on the fire sign doesn't have to be. Okay. Keep in mind, too, if you are making all this money and you're deciding to, you know, invest in a family member, give to a friend, um, uh, plan for something, um, <clears throat> although it's smart, right, and I, I definitely think that you know, your heart's in the right place here. There are people that are going to judge you that don't really like it. And if it's, and if you're giving to like a romantic situation, I feel like there's a possibility for them to take advantage of it. So just be mindful. All right. So new person guys, probably younger than you, definitely more immature than you. I don't know how much they have to bring to the table but again they don't mean any harm they're they're not the seven of swords um my concern is like i said i think they might expect a little too much of you or or expect you know financial help or something of that nature where they won't um like they won't appreciate it the way they should what else for scorpio It's saying that whole possible reconciliation again, especially if it's an earth sign, don't do it. They're still messing around with other people. I don't think you were going to do it anyway, Scorpio. I'm just saying it's there. Anything else for Scorpio before I end this for September? This is very September-y feeling deck right now. Yeah, getting out of some sort of funk, dealing with a new fire sign. This is not an old person, okay? And keep in mind, if like you... If you were to purchase a business, if you were to purchase a building, if you were to purchase anything that, that um, you know, could potentially make you money in time, expect some, you know, bumps in the road. It looks good long term, but expect some bumps in the road. Okay, Scorpio, I think that's pretty good. And like I said, I'll try to... If I'm feeling better tomorrow, I'll get up some extra content. But if not, we'll just have to start Monday on a completely different wavelength or something. Okay, hope this helps.